everyone welcome to my channel in this video i'm going to be doing a wet test on a nars tinted moisturizer so if you guys are interested in this product please continue watching and if you enjoy today's content please give it a big thumbs up subscribe to my channel so i can create more contents like this tinted moisturizer it is spf 30 it has titanium dioxide and dioxide and octinose in here and i got in a shade medium also known as micronose and it gives out a pure radiant look so let's open this package up and this is how the moisturizer looks like and it has dimethicone in here as a moisturizer it doesn't have any water resistant property to it okay so i really like this color already the consistency is a little bit runny and it looks very silky so i am very excited It has a little bit of fragrance to it. I really like this finish. The formula blended out really fast and it absorbed into my skin really fast as well. My face looks so healthy, so radiant, and so fresh. I really like this finish. So far, I really like the finish and the consistency of the sunscreen. I'm going to wear it for the rest of the day and see how it goes. So it has been 4 hours and this is how my skin looks like. Now the formula is a bit oily for my skin, but I really like the finish and the consistency of the sunscreen. I'm just going to reapply to see how my skin looks. And no pills. So it has been eight hours and this is how my skin looks like. Now I'm very impressed with this NARS moisturizer. My skin still looks very radiant, very glowy, very healthy looking. And it was a little bit oily earlier, but after I reapplied the moisturizer on my skin, it has been looking like this. So I really, really like it. Uh, the only thing it's missing for me is the water resistant property to it, but it's okay. I love the texture, the finish of this moisturizer, and also the coverage of the moisturizer because I feel like I'm wearing a light layer foundation and my skin tone is very even the only thing I feel like the moisturizer does oxidize a little bit because when I apply the moisturizer on my skin the color was a little bit lighter but as the time goes on it does look like my face is a bit darker than the color I initially apply on my skin so I would definitely get a lighter color than what you normally get overall I love everything about this moisturizer and definitely going to continue using this moisturizer the two other expert moisturizer I like to compare to and the first one is the honest beauty moisturizer moisturizer here this one is spf 30 and it has vitamin c in it uh, this moisturizer is very oily for my skin if you have drier skin than me you would like the honest beauty moisturizer better so you can see here the honest beauty moisturizer is definitely a little bit more oily than the nars 
And the other SPF moisturizer I like to compare to the NARS is my Dermatology Moisturizer. This one has a universal shade, so there's only one shade. And it's SPF 46. The consistency is a little bit lighter. And the color is a little bit lighter. The coverage is a bit less. But it's definitely less oily than the Honest Beauty Moisturizer. If you're looking for a tinted SPF moisturizer and your skin is on a drier side, check out the Honest Beauty Moisturizer. This one has a bit more oil than the other two. And this one has a medium coverage. But if you're looking for a lightweight tinted moisturizer, go for the Dermatology Moisturizer. This one has only one color and the color is universal. The texture and the consistency is not a lot lightweight, but yet has enough coverage. So I really enjoy using this moisturizer as well. Now, if you're looking for a medium coverage tinted moisturizer, check out the NARS. This one I absolutely love because it does make me feel like I'm wearing a light layer foundation. It has enough coverage for me where I don't see any uneven tone on my skin. And it is not too oily for me um, because I have really oily skin. But I'm really happy that this product works really well for my skin. And that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!